The summer of 1912 in Villisca, Iowa. A man stepped off a train and into the lives of eight people who were soon to become his victims. On June 9th, his actions would become known as one of the most gruesome mass murders ever to be committed and would go down in the annals of history as the Villisca Axe Murders. The slaying would leave a blood stain on the small town of Villisca, forever associating it with such a heinous crime. Believed to be a vagabond drifter, the man exited the train in the unsuspecting town in search of a place to stay under any circumstances. Traveling until he found a place, he watched the inhabitants. While they were away, he prepared to carry out his insidious acts. Brandishing an axe found by a woodpile, he entered the home. There, he hid in an upstairs closet where he would lie in wait for his victims to return and night to fall. Then the slaughter began. Police were left baffled by a lack of motive and the audacity to kill an entire household of eight so brutally. And as quick as he came, he was gone.